<laughs> Alright, ladies and gents, what up? It is your favorite Asian robot right here, and you know what? I just had a big meeting with my boys in the Discord and all that, and now I felt like I got two hours. I'm gonna wind down. Let's take a walk on my old place of being. <laughs> I want to see. I want to see if anything's changed with this game. Let's have a look. Mm. Okay. Welcome strangers. Welcome ye nerds to this place. Oh, I can already feel the toxicity seeping from me. Love it. Okay. Let's see let's see uh what the shit fest is looking like. Well, I can't even remember my controls anymore. Uh, so sorry. I'm just gonna decline all these people for now. Okay, first and foremost, gonna get into the game and test things out. Let's see. Let's let's reconstruct some of my old builds. I think first things first, I'm going to start with uh, the most basic of the basics. Screw the weapon trackers and all that. Pointless. Well, hello, Nate. I haven't seen you in a dragon age. What brings you here, my friend? Hmm. I'm seeing several faces whom I never see on my other streams. I'm gonna judge all of you. I'm judging all of you right now. Do you know that I'm judging you? Because I'm judging all of you. Hello! Greetings, strangers. Greetings all you strange human beings who dare exist in this place, who dare even speak to me. <laughs> I loosely remember what I'm supposed to do, loosely. Or was it something like, oh yeah. No, it wasn't, was it? I believe I took a different approach. I just can't remember what that approach was. Oh, yes. That's right. This was that approach. I can't remember what I put in the last one either. I know I slapped something in there. Can I use anything else? I'm just thinking about it. I think it was something like that. Should work. All that's left should be Pert and Pulse. Yeah, that looks about right. All good. I'm just giving. I'm just giving you shit, Nate. No, thank you. Okay, let's go mess around. Oh, these chain blades are level twenty. That's no fun. Ah, this dude bought the cash grab skin. What a loser. Hello, welcome. Welcome all you strange people. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, old chain blade build constructed. My answer, Wizard Kelly, is that if you want to play this game well, follow only Asian robot builds. Don't ask me whether crits are good. All you need to do is follow the exact builds that are on my channel, and you will be great. Case in point, I just constructed this old chain blade build. Same old chain blade build from a long while ago. See for yourself. See for yourself whether it's any good. See with your own two eyes, and then you can see whether or not to believe me. Like I said, don't ever ask me whether this is good or that is good. There's no need to think. All you need to do is follow Asian robot builds because I am perfection. Is that understood? And what silver sword are you talking about, Bob John? Is there something I'm supposed to pick up? Yeah, it's been a minute because I quit this shit fest of a game, especially considering Captain Maelstrom, uh, Mr. Trails were, you know, literally evil racists, and the Reddit and the official Discord were allowed to be evil racists. So I had no reason to be here, but you know what? I was bored today. Came back to make fun of all the losers that still play this game. And prove that I'm still the king, after all. Yeah, I saw the trash sword they released for Christmas. Ah, oh, no thanks, Bob John. I'm not putting in any effort for this shit fest. Seems I still got the skills, though. No, he isn't. This Trails is a dickwad. When I was at 3, I will never forget the day. Now, I, I didn't used to talk about this, but now that I've got other games to play, I don't really care about revealing the details. When I was three, at 300 subs and streaming Destiny 2, Mr. Trails came to one of my streams to tell me to change the titles on my videos because I was misinforming the public. So, no, Mr. Trails is the world's biggest asshole. I think he's evil. Of course, Dissidia. All my builds will carry you. Asian robot builds are superior to everything. That is the truth of the matter. Now, whether some people want you to believe otherwise, that's up to them. But like I said, if you use Asian robot builds, you probably won't go wrong. Probably. Now, some of you may recognize this. This is the so-called unlimited spin chain blades. They're pretty fantastic. Oh, well, congratulations on getting that. I hope the legendary silver sword is serving you well. I mean, not like they could have made legendaries for other stuff, right? Has to be a sword. I think they're running out of creativity at this point. <laughs> oh, this amuses me. Good to see that my old builds still work, though. There is nothing to do, Wizard Kelly, obviously. Why do you think I was so bored of this game? There is nothing to do in Dauntless. Like I said, I'm just here to see if things have changed at all. Here for a minute, just to uh, enjoy myself and then leave. It really hasn't changed, has it, River Archer, eh? This is my old absolutely broken chain blade build and it's uh, still working just fine. Still slaying behemoths, uh, very much higher than me, as I always do. <laughs> welcome, welcome everybody. Your king has returned, you may kiss my feet. Oh yeah, River Archer, lots of people have tried to steal my builds. I don't really give a flying fuck at this point. Because they've got no creativity. 
No, nobody can beat the king, and we all know that. <laughs> Wizard Kelly, I hate Dauntless with a passion. This game is a worthless piece of shit that never changes. And that's why I seek work elsewhere. Well, I've been streaming every day, Macaulay Mitchell, which means that you haven't been watching my streams of other content. Very disappointing, my friend. It means you're not a true Asian robot fan. Because my true fans follow me across games. I'm a Dark Tide partner now. I only came back here because I was bored. So I decided, you know what, I've got two hours. Let's see if this piece of shit game has changed at all. After all, worthless trash belongs in the trash. And I'm just here to prove, of course, my skills and power. Because as you can see, I'm still king. Asian robot builds are still the top tier. This is my old build from what, six months ago, seven months ago? I can't even remember anymore. Ah, okay. In that case, prove your determination. I will see you at my Dark Tide streams, yeah? And my Overwatch streams. Look at this level 10 strike just dying off. I think we'll go smash the trial after this. May as well, right? Are you freezing, Bob John? Freeze more. Freeze in the icy cold. Suffer. Okay, let's go smash the trial for shits and giggles. <clears throat> Who do I main in Overwatch? Come to my Overwatch streams and you'll find out. Although tonight, maybe I won't be playing Overwatch. I've got a new game to test tonight. I think some of you will enjoy it. So alive. Make it last forever Hypnotized By the sounds of breathing in How does it feel to have made so many builds? It feels normal I made these so that players would have easy access to builds Because builds are easy to make They're free They don't require any fantastic thinking or special thoughts, no Good old, same old, same old. Okay, what kind of creature is it that we're facing? Oh, it's the Phalanx. Okay, let's go beat it up. EG. Alright, we want to beat up the Phalanx, don't we? I'm going to think for a minute. Much better. Why not? Why not? Of course. 
With Dark Tide, I'm still learning a lot. So please enjoy. Please enjoy. Okay, let's go see if I can beat this thing. Let me see if I can remember how to do trials after all this time. Da 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 da. One whack and it could be all be over for me. It's part of the fun. Bing. Oh dear, took a hit, did I? Oh dear, how doubly irritating. Come on, Phalanx, don't be such a nerd. Let's have some fun, shall we? Oh damn, that wasn't accurate. Um, I don't know anything about that. As far as I know, the gauntlet was supposed to be a permanent addition. Yeah. Three minutes, not bad. Could go wilder with this if I wanted to. But I won't. For now. 
But that was hilariously amusing. What did you witness? You witnessed me whacking things. Huh. Is this... I knew you could do it. We need to talk, Slayer. No, we don't. Heroic Escalation speedrun? When you donate enough money, I will. But otherwise, no. I have no reason to do so. Hmm. Chain blades. Warpike. Hmm. What to construct? Hmm. Why not? Let's go with the old stuff. <laughs> or should I? Nah. <laughs> Mm. Oh. Well, let's go with exactly that. This will do. And then I bother? Yeah, okay. We can do that. Of course, and then for the grand finale. Do I even wish to bother with a defensive cell? Eh, I've got a revive in there. So... Hmm. Temptation. Oh, I could just stuff Cascade in there. You know what? Let's stuff Cascade in there. Let's see how I would fight something with the absolute lowest gear possible. Eh, nah. I am not paid enough to do that, Nate. <laughs> Certainly not, no. I'm just here for- I'm just here for a casual stroll. I don't love Dauntless enough to do something like that. Shoot. 
I'm just adding timestamps as I go along. Ezeldeen Sultan. What a lovely name. Welcome. All I'm here to do is mess around. Maybe I'll put out a video later. I'll think about it. Fighting something with the absolute lowest gear possible? Nah. Definitely not paid enough to do this. Hmm? You know deep down you love Dauntless? Nope. Absolutely hate this game. Like I said, I literally came back because I was bored. Okay, let's go see what I can beat up. <laughs> ah, good. I have a disadvantage against the Koshai. Good enough. This is where the fun begins. Look, Ma, no hand. <laughs> Good to know my old stuff still works, eh? And I wonder what happened to those people who believe that my stuff doesn't work. I hope they're doing well in life. Remember, trusting false information is the surest way to get yourself in trouble. I.e. don't. Da -da 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 -da.
Aww. Not that death matters. Ooh, special. Not really. Once you master dealing with him, he's not too bad. And there's a lot that I'd say is worse. The only thing that would ever even qualify as annoying with the Rift Stalker is the simple fact that uh, the hitboxes are janky. As demonstrated here, the annoyingly irritating hitboxes are the only thing that makes this a negative experience. Truth be told, if the interrupts hit normally, then it's not a problem. As you can see, I technically should have hit him. But instead, it was my spin attack that had to do the job. So this is problematic. But not that they'll ever change it, so... I guess you'll have to live with it for now. Let's go mess around in an escalation. Whatever it is, private hunt, let's go. Where's my holy music? Ah, there we go. go. Heal me if you can, Scrave Boy. And done. Here I thought I'd get a revive.
There we go, much better. They still have the invisible rift stalker bug. Ah. Well, isn't that cool? Oh dear. Oh dear. I was downless. Boring as ever. Just beating an escalation at level 11. While not caring. One second. It is still the same old, same old. I'm literally just here to shatter souls. Whatever shall I do? Oh dear, I am dead. Oh double dear, I am super dead. 
Oh dear. Ah, <laughs> uh, looks like level 11 with the Thunder Deep Drask is too much for me. Let me readjust this a little bit. If I want pure invulnerability... Other than wounding, I think I'll just make a Bastion. That might make more sense. Okay. Do over. Yeah. That. This. That, this, um, yeah, that'll do. Actually, wait, we'll probably need this first. Then... That. Like so. Effect. On something else. Could do something like that. Instead, no, then let's dump this one because it's not useful enough for me. Yep, better. Okay. I semi have what I need. Mm, that should do. Roughly, this will work. Never seen this game, Craig? Good. Don't ever see this game, it's terrible. How would I feel about Dauntless Story Mode? I would not care. I have no love for this game. Like I said, just here to mess around. I'm literally just here because I had spare time. And then number two, felt like teasing some of the nerds, so I have to show off that my builds are still king. Maybe not all of them, but whatever can make life very easy for players, that is what I will do. That is exactly what I'm doing here. Boing. Me a civate boy.
you. Snap parts of hmm. is okay, even with terrible plays. Do I still have haters? Of course. I think they're still very salty that I exist at all. But again, not that it matters to me. Doesn't bother me at all. They can choose to stay salty for the rest of their lives, or they can choose to do something about their lives. Up to them, really. For me, I'm just going to do my thing my way. Yes, yes, Beaver, I'll get to you. Relax, Beaver, relax. Come on, then. Wow, I love how the thing failed. I actually deflected it, and the ball, like, completely missed the Stormclaw. Good to see that uh, hitboxes don't ever change in this game. <laughs> bang, bang, bang. Well, Mr. Demon. The only time you'll be able to get my haters is if you actually support my other content. So, no thank you. I don't think you'll be able to get anybody. You really want to get somebody? Captain Maelstrom, Mr. Trails. The worst of the worst. Do what you will with them. Although I don't think you have any power to do anything to them. So, please. Uh, we are a channel that is based on facts. Don't try and give me these pleasant thoughts. I don't work that way. Flattery will get you the grave. Hmm. This works well up to round two. Let's see if it can do round three and four as well. Yeah, the janky hitboxes still there. Gun round to the face. Huh? In one of my video videos, I stated having been 
into real estate. I've never been into real estate. Uh, I ask you very kindly, Wizard Kelly, please do not ever say anything that is untrue. Because I've never once said that. I have never been into real estate, ever. If I was into real estate, I'm quite certain I would be rich enough to not be a streamer, so... Wouldn't even need donations. So no, I don't know where you heard your facts from, but I have never been into real estate ever. You can post whatever emojis you like, S Demon, but the fact is, I haven't seen you outside of my Dauntless content, so... Can't really trust somebody that doesn't fully support me, am I right? It's always interesting to see. I come back to this game, see who randomly turns up and is like, Oh yeah, I still love your content. Are you sure? Are you very sure? Hmm. I thank you for admitting it. Because like I said, I can't stand fake shit. It's okay if you're only interested in one thing, but just don't lie to a streamer. Or rather, don't lie to other people. Because it only proves one point. It means that when I'm gone, and when I'm not streaming this game, y'all aren't interested in my content. It means that y'all are watching other people when I'm not on. You only come back because you think that maybe I'll do something cool or create something cool. Nah, that's not right. And that's not the community I wanted to cultivate from the very beginning. Which is why I know who my true friends are who have accompanied me across many different games. That I can respect. And I don't expect people to love me absolutely, that's okay, if you don't want to, I don't really care. But, you know, never lie. Always be truthful, honest, and have integrity. Don't say things you don't mean. Because you do that, you're the one who's gonna lose out in life, not the other person. No, you do not. If you did, you would have been here every day. So it's okay, like I said, don't lie. I don't need, I don't need to be placated. I really don't care, I'm just here for fun. I'm just here to diss this game, check it out, see if anything changed. And now that nothing's changed, I'll probably go back to what I'm actually doing. So, I'm not worried about that. Although I will probably put out a short video. I'll probably film it live and show like all the builds that I've done today. For those who are ardent fans to still use. Oh yeah. Good boy, Malky. Stay down. <laughs> Good boy, Malky. Stay in your place. Oh look, I'm in his mouth. You can't damage me, Mal. You know better than that. <laughs> oh, 
her. Good. How do I get so much shield? Just follow my Bastion builds, Rage. Let me guess. The Dauntless official in the Reddit no longer talk about me. <laughs> you want to know how I get so much shields? My build is timestamped in the stream. And I'll do a video later showcasing this exact build. I am still the king of Dauntless. I make the best builds, hands down. But I quit. Because of racism. From the Reddit, official Discord, as well as from two very lovely partners known as Mr. Trails and Captain Maelstrom. I hate them and this game with all my heart and soul, but I'm still the best. So yeah, you can have whatever I have. If you want my older Bastion builds, they're still on my channel and they still work. You never need anything from a current patch. The old stuff from old patches still works, absolutely. Just so you know. That's done. Now for now for the sword. <laughs> oh, stream's always fine, roses. I'm just chilling out. Return to my old stomping ground. There's a monster to rip off. Exactly, Craig. Not only that, it's a cash grab whose devs don't ever update the game. They really don't care. Wizard Kelly, any build from after patch 1.0 is still working. 1.80, yeah. So, yeah, more or less, most of them are still working. More or less. I bother with the sword. Mm. Yeah, maybe I will. Just for the giggles. Well, after all. I want to make and create a lazy build. The laziest of them all. Go with the old style. Yeah, you know what? Let's go with the old style. Why not? It's been a long time since I've run that style. There you are. Here I will take my good old fashioned. There you are. This one will get dumped for that. We have everything we need. Should I bother with the last one? Or should I just go ham? Decisions, decisions. Yeah, okay. Why not? Hello, Salad Biscuit. Welcome. 
But yeah, this is a major monster hunter ripoff. It's simple. Like the plus points of this game was the simple fact that it was uh, easy to get into, free and crossplay. Oh, of course. Um, if I recall, somebody will be. This game was easy to get into, free to play and crossplay. Those are the main attractions. And of course, the fact is you don't have to ever like prepare for hunts or anything like that. Which I would say is probably um, like the more positive points about all this. Um, the more negative points are that, uh, well, the game is kind of doo-doo. This is morning in Australia. I stream when I have time. Yes, they do. Hey, Robert. How you doing? Most of the times I stream during the mornings. Well, my night. US morning. Those are my peak hours anyway. So I'm okay with that. I am A-OK -okay with that. That is my time to stream. Now it's just, I'm just here for fun. Messing around with some old stuff, proving that I'm still the king after all. Yep. Mr. Trails and Captain Maelstrom. You know, they talk so much shit, but every day, even while I was playing Dark Tide, I kept getting comments on my Donna stuff. How do you do this? How do you do that? So today I had a bit of time and I was like, you know what, let's come back for a little bit of fun, see if anything's changed. Game clearly hasn't changed at all. And all my old shit still works, so I figured, you know what? Let's go, let's go torture these souls. Gotta remind them that they'll never get out of my shadow. What's it like in Australia? Hot. It's summer. Level 2, fighting a level 10. Probably not the wisest decision, but meh. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Was fun. Now to get to level three. There we are. Oh look, I see escape instead. Wow, challenges that I'm completing just by existing. Did I just complete the challenge three times? This is bugged, isn't it? 
Let's see if it'll pop up again. Oh, wow, it does. Wow, I've completed Icy Challenge like six times, guys. Incredible. Good to see that this game is as buggy as ever. <laughs> All right. Um, to be honest, I don't really think too much about what's upcoming because I can't afford most things anyway. So I just, I just sit and chill. And if somebody wants to uh, sponsor something for me, I'm down with it. But other than that, I don't have to worry about it or think about it too much. So other than Wild Hearts, which I know somebody's sponsoring, I don't really have anything on my radar. Uh, maybe if a campaign pops up or whatever that I really like, then I might, uh, I might do that, but, um, other than that now. Like, for me, I'm just chilling. Like, if something good comes my way, I will, but, uh, other than that now. So pretty much only Wild Hearts is on the menu for now because I know uh, Miss Eve will be sponsoring that. Beyond that, I haven't thought too much about it. When stuff releases, if I if somebody decides to sponsor for me, then usually I play that. But other than that, I'm just uh, straight chilling. I guess the twisted benefit of being poor, you don't really care. <laughs> you just take what comes your way. I do have some other jobs lined up later in the year, maybe, but we'll see. Um, So you basically just email me at realasianrobot.com, well, realasianrobot at gmail.com. And you just say, hey, this game is coming out X at XYZ time. I would like for you to play it. Uh, I want to sponsor a stream. And I'll say, okay. That's basically all it takes, but you have to describe the game to me and tell me about it. Like, there are some games that I will not play. For example, games with survival mechanics, like, oh, you have to craft this or build this economy. Games that are, like, mostly crafting based, like, oh, you build this to, like, I don't know, uh, satisfactory. V Rising, games like this, I pretty much charge because I get bored out of my mind playing those types of games. I don't like them. I charge about $40 per hour um, for the streams of those games. Um, but if it's like just a normal game and people just want to buy it for me and see me play it, then I usually say, okay, you know, I'll do it. MMORPGs, FPS, all the good stuff is interesting to me at least. But uh, anything with survival and crafting mechanics, hard pass. Hard pass. Horror games are nice too. They are scary and fantastically fun.
if it's the if it's that Wukong game, please hit me up for that. I will happily play that shit. Souls like games are fun because you get to see me die horribly like an Elden Ring. Really? I never heard of that. Let me see. Let me have a look. No, oh, maybe I maybe I read the title wrong. I'm pretty sure this is the game that I was talking about. Or is that or is that a different game? Well, it doesn't matter. Yeah, sure. Looks looks Dark Souls enough. I'd probably play that. Oh God. Okay, sure. How bad could it be, right? I mean, I'll just die like 15 billion times. I'll get. I can live with that. Come on, you beaver. Get over here. Oh, you filthy nerd. Actually killing me, huh? Just because you're six levels higher? You dare? Peasy lemon squeezy. Let's go smash the Pangar's face in. Let's go handle an event, because why not? Let's go face some of the toughest baddies here.
Would you mind, random creature? I'm trying to slay you. Oh, and slide into me. There we go. Harried. You are done. Weakness, I see. Break the earth. Your skills are no match for mine, monster. My sword seeks a vengeance. Oh look, a double. Alright. Let's go after the weaker link first. Okay, that's one down. Now then, come here, big boy. Fight me. You cannot- Oh, Wait, what? I literally parried that and still took a hit. Wow. What the hell happened in the one month I was- well, Close to two months I was gone. The hitboxes like got worse. That's a trip. I don't mean the pleasant vacation kind. Oh, come on. How dare you move so much when I'm trying to smash every bit of your soul. Yeah, I couldn't animation cancel that. At least not fast enough. There we go. Come at me, buddy. Double. Good to see my old stuff still works. Nope, game hasn't changed at all. Still absolute dung fest. And of course, Asian robot builds are still kicking ass as per normal.
Boing. Okay, that's done. Um, let me see, actually. Honest, might make more sense if I just uh, Jack be nimble, Jack be quick. This won't work. I need something different. Um, what can I use that actually gives me some potency here? No. 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 that's not gonna work so that means this one will have to change over then this is of no use has to be something more useful. Okay, that works. And then all I'm left with is... But then there's no pulse. Bugger. Okay, um. Is 
it really worth it? Mm. December 1 update good? No. Not at all. I mean, I didn't even participate in it. I, honest to God, care very little. So, yeah, that is what I have to say about that. Okay, this should work. Shoot, let's go have some fun. Oh yeah, I recognize your profile picture, so I figured you're the same person. After this quick test, I will go shoot a video. Okay, let's go finish this with gloriousness. Boing, boing. Alright, come on. My favorite build of absolute laziness. Yes, come on. Yes, come on. Yep, still works. <laughs> still worthy of granting behemoths insta death. Well, I am not back, Ethan. I'm just here for two hours. Nothing's changed anyway. I'm literally just here to show off some of my old builds still working, and that's it. Um, I will not be making a return, so I'm sorry to disappoint you. Like I said, it's really not worth playing a game where racists are employed, i.e. Mr. Trails and Captain Maelstrom. There's no reason for me to suffer through that again. I'm just literally here to, uh, well, in a mean-spirited way, see how the game's doing, check if it's dying, and then, you know, do my thing. That's literally about it. So, I do apologize. I wish I could uh, meet your expectations, but uh, definitely not coming back. Aww, look at my death. How glorious. We go. <laughs> well, the test is completed. Let's go film a video live, shall we? Just for the fun of it.
Good. That's because the Dodge Master is still awesome. administrative business in the background. found anything new tune into tonight's stream we're streaming something new might be interesting I don't know I've got my assistant there with me also um no I only play with channel members and obviously I'm not actively playing this game so i apologize ethan but channel members only and like i said i'm not actually coming back to this game so again i do apologize for disappointing you but i'm not returning to dauntless i'm just here today to make fun of this the uh, game to be fair that and show off some of the old builds that i have still working in fact we're actually going to record the video live right now well ladies and gents Coming to you live from my stream, I came back to Dauntless for one day to see if anything changed. Pretty much nothing much has changed. And uh, what I can say to everybody is that here I am showing off my builds once again. These are the same builds that have been working since forever. So I'm just going to dip my overlay. Alright. And first and foremost... You might recognize this. This is the Dodge Master Chain Blades. Still working well. Death Blossoms, Molten Cell, Pulse Cell. I made some slight modifications, but either way, it's still roughly the same. Reaper's Dance, Hurricane Blades, Sovereign Slash. Easy, right? Tempest, Omni Cell, Shrike Zeal, Molten Cell, Spellbound Hood, Invigorated Cell, Scraving Jacket, Sprinter Cell, Fiery Gauntlets, Pulse Cell. Phalanx's Heat Sinks, Fleet Footed Cell. Overall, what you're gonna have, plus 6 Fleet Footed, 35% movement speed, plus 6 Invigorated, 50% movement speed, as long as you're below 50% stamina, plus 6 Molten, another 20% movement speed, Pulse, to time your uh, Tempest Dashes for crits, Adrenaline, extra damage, Endurance, extra damage, Sharpened, uh, this just comes with the Koshai Bond, you can't really change that, and Sprinter, another 10% movement speed, Overall, there's a lot of movement speed in this build. How's it gonna feel? Well, let's taste it. Heading on over to Thunderwatch. I guess you guys have missed this video format, huh? No bullshit, all legitimate. You know, ever since I left to play Darktide, I've been getting comments almost every day on my videos. That's why I decided to wander back in today. Why not? Let me have a look-see at this shenanigans. Alright. Let's go find the biggest, meanest thing here and kill it. Hey, Zexon. Alright. Like I said, I'm filming this live on stream because I can. Oh, it looks like a Flameborn Nasher. My chain blades are currently level 5. Let's go.
Oh, my dodge skills are imperfect. Oh well. Come here. Oh no, time to dodge the big bad fireballs. Do you guys see that janky ass animation? Gotta love it. Okay. Now, let me show you a double. And then before this thing dies, oops, that missed. Guess I'll just have to dodge it manually. All right, come on. And there, killed just by dodging. Even though I haven't played for two months, it's still up and running. Yeah, let's return to Ramsgate. I'll show you some of the other builds that still work. This entire footage will be unedited so that you guys can uh, actually see what we've done. However, I did timestamp it in the stream and the stream link will be in the description of the video. So that you guys can actually see us actually doing our testing as we always did. I bet some of you have missed that. Okay, next on the list. Check it out. This is the Thrax Sword. I... Updated a older style of uh, sword build, right? What I'm gonna give you is pretty simple Void Bane, that's from Thrax, uh, bonded with Riftstalker, yeah? Mending Blade Core, because I'm lazy Avenging Overdrive, because I'm lazy Etheric Attunement Cell, Overpower Cell Now you could put in a defensive, another defensive cell if you want, but it doesn't really matter Discipline Omni Cell Shrike Zeal with Etheric Attunement Sight of Stone with a Toughness Cell Back to Shadow with a Cunning Cell Boreal Might with the Berserker Cell. Volcanic Treads with the Berserker Cell. Overall, what you're going to have, 1,300 hit points, which allows you a 26% damage bonus from Tenacious. Plus 6 Berserker, up to 35% damage bonus. Cunning for 10% crits to pair with Discipline. Assassin's Frenzy, you break apart, you get ex extra attack speed. Overpower, just because you will stagger things with this. And Etheric Attunement to make sure you can make more use of Strike Zeal. The idea here is survive with your Mending Blade Core and strike your enemies down. You guys ready? Oh, looks like it's Thunderwatch again. Okay. So, enjoy. Hmm. But this is fun. <sighs> As in the build, not the not the game. The build is fun. If you enjoy this game. Now the first build was the same old Dodge Master. Hardly any real difference. This one is a bit more unique. I altered the old Savate Discipline Sword and made it more killy. Not gonna lie, it's a little wild, but it works in general. That and I kind of enjoy the attack speed. All right. The biggest and meanest thing here is a Nezaga and a Trask. Let's go beat him up, shall we? La 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 Now with discipline you can parry most things that come your way. I'm still bad with the timing having not played after a month, but as you can see, even if I take damage, it's not serious. We don't use Predator or any of the other stuff in this build, so honest to god, you're not in a lot of danger of losing your bonuses. I specifically made this because, uh, returning after a long break, please, do you really expect me to actually have any of the skills I had back in the day? Nope. Totally washed up even after a month of- after a simple month of not playing. That's okay. My parries are still somewhat on point. 
That and you can get your uh, explosive damage going with this quite fast. Like I said, and there's really no risk because you gain off your uh, you gain off your um, avenging overdrive. Sorry, you parry with your avenging overdrive, and you gain from your attack speed. So, honest God, you should be all right. And regaining health with mending blade core is fairly easy. So take hits if you need to. It will reduce your overall damage bonus from uh, Nacious, but honest to god, not a big problem. Like I said. Oh, it's dead. Okay. Great! Oh, that's beautiful. Let me go beat up the Nezaga. Because why not? The Dodge Master is for those skilled at dodging. This one is for if you just want to bash it in the face. And what better way to utilize it than to use the king of bashing in the face, the sword. Now come at me. There we go. My favorite. I do so love putting down two of these. Yeah. And then a third. Oh. How dare this thing try and knock me away, huh? Parry. If your parry is offline or, you know, you don't have any other option, that's when you use discipline. But most of the time, you should slay things pretty fast. There you go. So, that's another kill. Let's head back to Ramsgate and I'll show you the third and final build I prepared today. Like I said, as you know, to prove that there's no hanky panky, we don't even cut the loading screens. So I'm sure you guys don't mind sitting through, right? To get the very best builds in all of Dauntless. Now, Last but not least, okay. Y'all thought it was gonna be the Warpike. Aha, but it's not, no, I'm kidding. It is the Warpike. So, I made this one plain and simple, very easy to use. Um, Cold Hell, Cascade Cell, Predator Cell, okay. Concussive Payload, Balanced Spearhead, Wolf's Frost Wolf's Rip. Bastion as your Omni Cell, Scarn's Defiance, Etheric Attunement Cell, Drascale Helmet, Berserk Cell, Vax of Shadow, Cunning Cell, Wolf Claws, Aegis Cell, Wolf Paws, Berserker Cell. Basically, this build is designed to help you build up shields really fast, so your Cunning and Galvanize give you good crits. Uh, Berserker and Predator will be your main source of damage. Cascade will also be another source of healing and shields. Um, with the only thing that with this that you can vary is that you can change over to Savage Wellspring if you need the extra crits, but Honest God should not uh, be too much of an issue. Alright, let's go. Hades Reach. Let's go have some fun. And Heroic Escalations. You can actually take the old Heroic Escalation builds that I did for the Chain Blades, Ethan. And slap them on the Warpike. It should still work. But it's better to do Heroic Escalations with the Chain Blades. Because they're much easier to dodge with. In my opinion. So that's what you could do. You are welcome. I hope you enjoy. Okay, hunting grounds. As we, as you know, no bonuses pertaining to anything special. The biggest, baddest thing here is an ember main. Alright. Let's go give it a smackadoo, shall we? Alien, shut your mouth. I'm not fighting you. For now. <laughs> Boing. Boing. Alright, and there's the Kember main. If you need to know how to interrupt stuff, please make sure you check out my video on that.
that's the reason why I made this so basic. It's because you fight something with easy interrupts. Well, you can do weird stuff like this. Now, this is not a wounding build, but it doesn't mean that you cannot wound with this build. And with Cascade sitting around, you can... Uh, You can give yourself extra damage, shields, pretty much everything you ever need. As you can see, even something 6 levels above you should not be too much difficulty. But of course I have an elemental advantage, so that makes this fight a lot easier. That and Ember Main is, you know, pretty much the easiest thing in the world to interrupt. So, yeah. Ethan, you don't have to cry when I log off. You can definitely carry my builds into Valhalla. But I'll tell you a secret. I'll tell you a secret. I may come back to diss the Dauntless Nerds again. So that's it. Three lovely builds. Asian robot style that still work. Sword, Chainblade, Warpike. Enjoy. Like, share, and subscribe if you like. But for now, farewell again. There we go. Video shot and done. I will post it tonight. Now, victory of Valhalla, right? Remember the lessons that I teach you. If you use an Asian robot build, you will literally never go wrong. Use my work well. Okay, ladies and gents. There you go. Alright, that's it for me. Thank you for joining me today. I'll see y'all this evening for some actual gameplay. Get you